from the students of Penn State Meteorology. Here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon. I'm David Guerrero from the Campus Weather Service here with your Wednesday afternoon forecast. Now, taking a look at the live cam, coming straight from Beaver's from the hub actually, we're seeing great conditions, mostly sunny, and that is due to the high pressure dominating our area, which will last a couple of days. And another story is temperatures reaching back to average. Current temperatures is 46 degrees, feels like 44. And as we take a look at the temperatures in our surrounding regions, Temperatures are back to average after that record-breaking week we had last week where we saw temperatures reach 70. Now we're back to normal. Temperatures are 46 degrees. Dubois, 50 degrees. Indiana, 52. Then as we head east, 47, 48. And then Harrisburg having the highest at 50 degrees. Taking a look at the larger picture of the Commonwealth. Philadelphia currently has temperatures at 53 degrees. Then as we head to the northwest, we'll see Erie and Pittsburgh all have temperatures at 53 degrees. So it's a day of similarities for Pennsylvania. Now, as we see the current, current conditions for Pennsylvania, clear skies, like I said. Currently, there's a rain system off the Great Lakes. But the big picture, the main story, is a tropical storm developing off the coast of Florida. And it will be a hurricane later today. Hurricane Nicole will cause issues for Florida and for Pennsylvania during Friday and Saturday. I'll talk to you later on the forecast about that. But for the future weather, clear skies for tomorrow. And then for Friday morning, cloud cover will start to increase. Then we'll have a familiar friend, Tropical Storm Nicole, which will be a low pressure system at this point. But it will give us moderate to heavy rainfall and the potential for thunderstorms for Friday. And then this will last Saturday morning which will affect us during the tailgates. But good news though, Nicole will go through the Northeast right before kickoff, so that's good news for the football team. Then on Sunday morning, the potential of lake effect snow will be in effect, and this will last for a couple hours. Now, as regards to the hurricane, Nicole is currently developing into a hurricane, and this potential landfall is at two o'clock, so in a couple hours, and the expected Landfall will happen at the, around the area of Port St. Lucie. So if you know relatives or if you're currently at the area right now, please t go into a higher level because storm surge is the highest cause of death for hurricanes. Now for today, temperatures will be at 54 degrees, mostly sunny winds coming from the south at 5 to 7 miles per hour. Tonight, similar conditions, mostly clear. Temperatures will be at 36 degrees, so you'll have a chance to take a look at the moon after that. Lunar eclipse from yesterday, then for tomorrow, clear skies. Temperatures will be at 60 degrees, so very seasonable, very nice. So go enjoy and have a picnic before our friend Nicole comes Friday. Then for Friday, obviously, Nicole come, giving us potential thunderstorms, have heavy rain. Temperatures will reach 65, though. Saturday, rain will be in the morning. We'll leave through the New England area, giving us sun and clouds which would be good for the football game, but a little wet on the field at uh, Beaver Stadium, so maybe a chance for the hard, maybe a hard time for the running backs. Then Sunday, temperatures will drop to 41 degrees, so we'll see temperatures be at the November level for next week. So say goodbye to the 60 degrees and the 70 degrees from last week because we're heading into 41 degrees maximum levels, the highs. And then Monday, 39 degrees. The lows will be at 23 degrees. So it will be pretty chilly during those times. And then we'll cap off with 40 degrees on Tuesday, mostly sunny. Now that, is that, now that is all the time I have for you today. Have a great week and enjoy the football game on Saturday.